today's video is going to be about this survival kit and fire kit and um, basically the only reason I have not shown this is because I forgot where I put it and that's a bad thing on me I really do not like forgetting where I put things but I have so I'm going to run the intro and where I'll take a power cord off while the intro's going on because there's so much power cord here, I can about 50 feet. So it'll take too long to show you when I'm on the video. Nope, we'll see you in a bit. Thank you very much. See you in a minute. Bye bye. Right, folks, welcome back. Right, as I said in the intro, this is a piece of kit I truly did forget about, and that is the survival kit and fire kit. I took it all off, as you as I said in the beginning. I put all the power cords like this. I roughly think there's about 50 feet here. I don't quote me on it, I don't know. So, yeah, right, this fire kit is exactly the same one. What's in my tin, my fire kit on my neck knife is exactly the same kit, so I'll put that up in the corner for you lot to go and check it out. And it is exactly the same one as my friend's got. We just built, I said I built him one, then I wanted it another one, so we built another one for me. So that's that. So this is the meat and the potatoes. This here is the survival kit I have now, what I did forget about. And this was done on the 28th of the 8th, 22. But there is a couple of new things in here before after that so i begin because it's coming over two minutes um one and a half minutes already so yeah right as you can see it is not okay stuff but there is a lot in here start off with there's these sc survival cards snare wire fishing line smash slash um I don't know what it is, fishing line slash something else, I can't remember. Um, and why saw? These do come from Wazoo Survival, they are good company. So, yeah, to go with the fishing line, there is some weight and some hooks. Um, very small beeswax candle. What I made up, I know these burn for two and a half hours. So, I know that, so that's quite good. I have one of these knife saw combo things. I don't know what they call it, but there's a little fair one there, and there's a small pry bar there. I thought this was fantastic to add to this kit, so I did. Um, I've added my Wolfson small torch. It does work. I've just changed the batteries around. I've checked that. This is the other new piece. This is the new piece of the kit. Is that compost? What I've got the Ranger SL. I think it's called. Cool. Oh, cool. So yeah, and it still points north. It's still really good compost. I've got a go of ice in here. Small signal wheel. Small amount of duct tape, a piece of um, some oil, signaling tape, purification tablets, what are still miles in gate, whistle, bell rod, striker, combo, whatever you want to call it, together. One of these stand up water bags. I don't know what they're called, so I'm just telling you that now. They just, just says stand up back up bag. So I got one of them in here. Last thing that is, oh no, second last thing, sorry. I have a frontal lens and well as a um for a blanket. This is the last thing, and I don't think I'll be putting these back in. Not strike anywhere matches. There is some strike on your matches in this one so they won't be going back in so yeah so that's everything what is in my forgotten survival tip so thank you very much for watching um we appreciate this video 
in this video. We appreciate everybody in this, who watches this video. Sorry, this seems a long video, but I just wanted to get this for you. I just wanted to show you what I truly did forget. So, yeah, and there was a bit, few more videos coming up on things I forgot about. So, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.